two of YC. It is week two of YC, but to be honest, it feels a little bit like the first real week. Uh, we're all in person, Sydney, Andrew, and I, we're all living and working out of our new SF apartment. We made so much progress this week and it was just really, really fun. Here's a look at what happened. So on Sunday night, we all met up at SFO and then Ubered over to our brand new apartment. In case you missed it last week, our original apartment in the Mission had no heating, so we were taking cold showers and there were some other weird things with it. And so we got very lucky and the YC community came to the rescue. There is this YC alum that uh, posted that he was gonna be out for a month. And oh my gosh, you guys, there are doormen that open the door for you in this apartment. Like I don't need to open my own door ever. It's pretty swanky and we are definitely going to be spoiled after living here for a month. We ordered food and did our Sunday night planning meeting. On Monday, we had our very first in-person group office hours. These are held every other week at the YC office over lunch with like eight other startups. And this week we were working on our two sentence descriptions of our startups. This is like an elevator pitch or a cocktail party pitch for your company. So we went around and each company said their description and then people gave a thumbs up sideways or down for how well they actually understood what the company did based on that description. Jared and Nate are two group partners and it was so impressive to see how locked in they were throughout the entire hour and a half. Um, we you know, went around and each company set their two sentence description. Sometimes it was said very quickly. I was struggling to just really listen and keep up. And they heard it once and could just remember it and reference back specific words or phrases that they liked or didn't like. It was just very, very impressive to see how present and locked in and listening they were. It was also interesting to see how much customized feedback they gave. Like, yes, YC has basically a formula and you can pick one of two formulas for how to write your two sentence description. But it was interesting to see how Jared and Nate broke the rules, so to speak, you know, uh, customized to each company. In some cases it was, you know, normally you should do this, but in your specific instance, you should really do this other thing because you fall into this exception. And that stuff is just hard to know if you're in it, right? Are you one of the companies where the average advice applies to or are you in that um, outlier? Our two sentence description basically got all thumbs up, which I was happy about. On Monday night, we had a group event. So this is dinner and then a speaker. In this case, we had a panel of speakers. These were recent YC alums, so folks who just finished YC in the spring, so they just finished up in September. And they came back and talked to us about their experience going through YC, their experiences with sales, with closing enterprise contracts, with fundraising, with pivoting. So that was very helpful. On Wednesday, we had individual office hours. These are 30 minutes where we meet with Jared and Nate and we talk about whatever is the most important issue for our company um, at that time. You often just need that little bit of prodding, the right prodding at the right time from people who have been there, done that, that can just save you weeks or months. And I feel like this week's office hours, uh, both Wednesday and then some conversations on Monday were exactly that for us. On Friday, there was this mini sales conference that I watched over Zoom, and it was very inspiring to hear stories of the hustle and creativity of past alums in talking to customers and figuring out how to get in front of them. And then other than that, we just worked from our new apartment. Every day we would wake up and be heads down coding. <laughs> We either had dinner out if we hadn't left the house all day, or we would eat in. I would typically exercise right before dinner. 
It also helps that there's a really nice gym downstairs. We had really productive late night conversations and all in all, it was just an awesome week.